Okay. Post this here. There, right there. Let's see where else? Where else? Where else can I look? Why are you smiling? I'm not smiling. I'm frowning. It's like misinterpreting. Oh. Let me see. General settings. No expressions. Sensitivity is that the problem? just remove the uh, smiling emotion from my thing maybe or perhaps come up with a better rig who knows demos that we're going to check out. Uh, I'm not sure which order I'm going to go in. Um, I didn't even know that we were going to, we were getting an Alien Hominid uh, sequel, but I guess we are. Uh, you know, there's a, there's, there's a little bit of everything in here, I think, like FPS, action RPG, um, 
I think Metroidvania. Uh, one visual novel that we'll talk about. We'll talk about a lot. Uh, I didn't see any racing games. I could check. I could check for uh, for racing games. Stray Souls. Ah, uh, no. Is there like is there sports and racing? Let me see. Avopug. No. Absorption. Oh, okay. Uh, but that's not safe for work. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh. I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll still look at it anyways, but we're not not on here. Not on here. I don't want to get banned. Ollie Frog Code Skater. Demolition Party. Arc Racer. Box to the Beat. That looks cool. Octane Remix. Skater Gator. Bump Stick. Uh, Punch Club 2. Ultra Toro 2. Um, Stunt Derby, Super Woden GP2, The Rifling Man, I don't know what that is. Doomsday Derby, Dream Swing, Formula, uh, Flipper, Flipper Soccer, that's interesting. Uh, I guess stunt. But, uh, oh, it's only six, six point ninety eight megabytes. Holy crap! Download already. Woke up half an hour ago, just in time for the stream. Oh, hey, Mal. Um, I'm, I'm looking at these expression things. Trying to keep it neutral, but oh, there we go, there we go. Hey, all right. I guess we'll look at um, Sea of Stars was probably the first one. So I guess I'll, I'll open that one up. Oh, well, I haven't, I've been kind of on and off with streaming. Now, what the f did I do to my settings? Work in progress, audio visual still. Hang on. Properties, where's, where's the cutoff thing? Where's the crop? Crop, right. Problem solved. Okay. Let's hold A to proceed. 
Oh, shit. Here we go. Let me... But, but happy to have you here, Mel. Pixel perfect now. So this is uh, something I saw on at like a Nintendo Direct. The main character select one who will lead the party. Yeah, he'll lead the party. But uh, I, from what I understand, this game has Super Mario RPG combat mechanics, which I really like. So, you know, we'll just take a quick look at it and then we'll try something else. I might, I might save, uh, <laughs> I might save, whoa, what happened there? No way, that was on. Yeah, what a ride. The Elder Mist wasn't kidding. So the eclipse will happen soon, but we're now closer to Wraith Island. Oh, he can, can he can toot. He can fart out of his hand. Found 99 gold. Uh, it's either Chrono Trigger or or Mario RPG. Yeah, what's this say? As I saw, I saw this. Ooh. Here we go. So I gotta figure out who's our magic. The non-boss enemy HP in combat. Party members recover one MP every time they block. I'll give it to you. I mean, this looks really good. It's... This sounds like, uh, oh, all right, all right, so here, here, let's see. Combo, how do you combo? Thunder. Yeah, the Pragmatic game. I forgot about that. Okay. 
Okay, so yeah, there is a block button. And they do have timely hits. From the looks of things. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, this is Mario RPG. Mechanics, I think. I'm just not like 100% sure what the timing is yet, but I will. I'll figure it out. As I feel like I, I, I really wish we had gotten like a proper Mario RPG sequel with that type of combat, but we never did, sadly. The, the music though it doesn't the music doesn't remind me of like 16-bit um, SNES games the music feels more like uh, Falcom PC games you know because Falcom put a lot of their games on PC like uh, Xanadu Next and all their yeast games It's always good when the level design in an RPG is a little more complicated. Oh, who's that? A few adventures later. making a deal with pirates they seem nice enough to me uh, yeah those, those guys all seem very nice who's that Captain Cliché's crew is here again. Somehow it feels like they have a more determined look than before. Successfully timing hits and blocks causes a star flare to fly out of the character. Recommended for those preferring stronger feedback. Uh... Yes. Yes, I I think I like that until at least until I got this figured out. The deal stands. If you can't beat Valtrade at arm wrestling, we got an item that needs fixing. After which Pirate's Honor will take y'all to Wrath Wraith Island. How do I beat him at Arm Wrestling? I wonder if I can beat him. I hope I can. You guys are too strong, it wouldn't be fair. What? <laughs> On three. One, two, three. Oh, fuck. Oh, 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 shit! Oh, no! We didn't even arm wrestle!
Hi. Captain, north of Risk is the abandoned lab of an arcane wizard who died long ago. It hasn't been opened for centuries, but stories say it conceals a coin of undeath accord. Why do you want it? Powerful token. Redacted for spoilers. <laughs> you know what? That's actually, honestly, the to, to leave some of the dialogue out for the sake of the demo, I think that's fine. I, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I should open the way. This dude's double eye patched. I'll stay here and make preparations for our departure. That's the coin of Undeath Accord, then meet me at the docks. Oh, we got this whole. We got the whole squad with us. Now what do we do? I want I want to do some combat. So they got like a cooking mechanic, like like Final Fantasy. I am trying to go to Wraith Island. Oh, I can't go in that door, or that door, or that door. Perhaps I can go this way. This, is, this part's Chrono Trigger, for sure. Um, I don't remember where they want me to go right now. Oh, but look at that dragon. Fishing-like? I, I don't know. I don't know. I know lots of people that... People, people love their robust fishing games. Ooh. Oh, oh, I see, I see. I, I don't see. I don't, I don't. But I caught jellyfish.
That's oh, simple enough. Is this the place they want me to go? The abandoned wizard's lab. I believe, I believe this is the place. Opens the gate! What are you looking for? I have found the door, but it seems that I will only be able to lift it a few inches. On your mark, pal. Commence! Yeah! Damn. Damn, this man's flexing. Yolandi, what are you gonna do? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh. oh I guess that works. What? <laughs> I, I need to play Tales of the Rise. What do we got? I can blow people. Damn it! I, ca I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> Man, I wish Castoria got a main game treatment instead of just making it a gotcha. The plot was ballsy given the time frame it released. It. I can, uh, I can, oof. I can use my wind powers to push people with air, which was once known as blowing them away. And then, but now I can't use that term. Oh, a campfire. Maybe later. Rest. They made during Twitter, which hunts and the plot openly criticized the court of public opinion. Oh, okay. You should be able to mix the light from different crystals to open new paths. Quite fascinating. Alright, what's this here? On your Mistral Blade bracelet to reach first to when it can push block. Alright, well I did that. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see.
There we go. That now we're talking. So not, yeah, this is this this is why I'm really excited for this game. Uh, I love I love when they have cool gimmicks in, in turn based RPGs. Like in Legends of Dragoon. Time your hits and blocks by pressing A at the right moment. Time blocks reduce incoming damage while time hits increase your damage output. Sometimes you can even score additional hits. There's a little more combat than what the demo's got. used to recover HP and MP. The campfire can be used to cook more snacks, carry limit 10. The level of challenge isn't to your preference.
I hop down here. Oh. Oh, there we go. Oh no! physical people. You also... Yeah, no, all of us need defense. That was interesting.
What's this do? Does it re it it does not restore the full after leveling up, unfortunately. System. Ah. Well, since all right, so let's do this. Cook. What do we got? That's all right. I'm sure there is, there is, hang on. There is an option to heal after combat, you know, just to make things a little easier. But since that doesn't seem to be, since that's off by default. I think I'll leave that off. I've already got the uh, the relic that gives clear confirmation on time tips. Oh, 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 oh. This is if I fuck up. Oh, whoops. I had no idea. I think... I know, I know this guy can heal, but, but Nourish heals more than, than that. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna give our, our plump dude. Ooh. Let's see what this does. Ah, I see. Well, that's what it does.
fuck? This game is not easy. See, look at, look at how much health is that. Ah, oh, shit. I thought I had it there. Alright. Easy. Ah, oh, what's round three? That's only two of them. drop. The good news is, at least everyone gets experience points, regardless of whether they fall in battle or not. Oh, fuck. I hit. I hit. I whipped. No! Oh. Don't die. Found a red crystal.
now what? What do I do here? I guess we, we try and check this out. There's a good chance this is... Alright, so let's, let me see. Let's try this. I guess that didn't do it. It might, I'm not 100% sure. First one is up to there. 
Oh, uh, okay. I guess. What's this? What's the scroll of the bass drop? Say what? Okay, cool. What's this do? Ah, oh, this opens up another one, I believe. But what I want to know is what happens. What's what's this one do? I know they, I know it's got to be there. See what this this is. Hey, right here, in the well. Huh? I lost my watch in the lake and a fish swallowed it. Would you mind catching it for me? It ought to be glowing. Yes. Ah, oh, shit. Wrong one. Come on, there we go. And I, I caught a golden watch. I did. There you go. Ooh, what did I get? Ooh. That was well worth the trouble. Mind you of Golden Sun? Yeah, a little bit. I didn't play a whole lot of Golden Sun, but yeah, I get that sort of vibe with, the, with this dungeon. Oh, fuck. Hello, anybody out there? Be careful, girl. We don't know what to expect here. I found something. That's a boss. <laughs> that's a that's an origami boss. What is that? It's a boss. Oh. Here we go. 
Here we go. Ooh. Oh, fancy. It resists that. Okay, so, uh... <laughs> shape shift. Uh, what's shape shift do? Oh, I think it's vulnerable. Ooh, ooh, fuck. Ooh, I'm in trouble. I guess that's the end of that. <laughs> that's the end of that demo. That's all right. I still have a lot more stuff to, to go through. But uh, it does look very good. What else did I download today? Uh, Fortune's Run, Beyond Sunset, Alien Hominid, Let's, uh, yeah, let's try Alien Hominid. Because I haven't tried, it's been so long. Portalist window. All right, so let's try this. Um, here we go. Behemoth Games. Uh, yeah, that alien hominid. They're they're making a sequel, I guess. Score on alien riding on lock cursor the window. Yeah, uh, I I don't know why. Oh, I like that it's uh, automatically. It's it's cute because I am using a Nintendo Switch gamepad, so it knows. I'm gonna play offline. Keep your stuff when you die, lose all items on death. Ah, uh, whatever. I mean, I've, I've played... I've played... I've played this game a lot. I've played... I've played Alien Hominid a 2004. Oh! 
It's the same cutscene. That's cool. Damn, dumb kids. Oh shit. Oh, 16 years later, that's cute. What am I doing? I'm a purple alien hominid. I guess, I guess this works. No, what the fuck? Move. Move left. Oh, I guess I still gotta work on it. <laughs> okay. Problem fixed. Wait, what? No! Move left, menu left. Oh, no, 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 no. Menu left. Move left. Fly layout. Okay. Ah, problem fixed. Maybe I should, uh... No. Oh, whatever. It's fine. For now. Maybe they're going for a Metroid style. Because right now it's like X to shoot. And and uh, A to jump, and then B to roll. But, you know, I have to switch back. Ah, okay, all right, all right. Oh, yeah, no, I think I have the buttons backwards. <laughs> Oh, but there's a dodge? That makes things easier.
It's the Cuphead tutorial? Yeah, a little bit. I wonder if the Cuphead guys work on this. Well, that works. Stars. This is 16 years after Alien Hominid 1. It's basically like... Very EDF plot, except... This time we're the aliens. Oh, that didn't do shit. Whoops. It's been many years since since the hominid showed up. We've got a lot of Look at this cool kid. Oh no! The feds! The feds! Why would the feds do that? No! The feds have gone too far stepping on our children's ice cream! Oh my god, look at that. Oh, difficulty rises with time. Oh my god, look at these guys go! Thank you, sir. Now, what are we- where are we going? Ah. Oh, good, good. I'm glad- I'm glad that's still in the game. Oh, buddy! Buddy! Ah! Oh, shit. This game, this game feels really chaotic. Oh my god. What's this do? What's this do? Are these FBI documents? Oh shit! Uh 
Oh god. an objective. Yes, I'll, I'll take all of these. Yes, give me give me all of them. I I'm gonna inflict chaos upon the feds. Purple enemies. Sounds good. This game runs on Temple OS. <laughs> Loot boxes. More, more stats. Whoa, hey, you found a box of loot. We can open it at our hideout. Where's our hideout?
go to the hideout. Or let's go to the let's see the bonus real quick. This is like alien hominid, but with a little bit of risk of rain. I'm not sure.
Bam, bam, bam. What's his bonus here? Diving underground will clear any negative status. Oh shit! I gotta get to... I gotta get to a hideout. next on the list i got lords of exile i got fortunes run sunset beyond Ju judero toizua knight of the alchemist stunt derby i could try stunt derby Look at this fucking... Yeah. Look at this fucking... <laughs> they're, they're really going for like a look here. Let's see. Let's see how this works. I'm gonna go automatic because I'm a coward. Day, tomb beaner. Like race driving, and I feel like that's the 
the look they're trying to go for. It was also called like hard driving in some instances. And this, I feel like they were trying to go for that look only more 3D because race driving was like very, very, very early 3D. And it ran like at like fucking 10 FPS. But it looked amazing at the time. Uh, let's see. Let's see what's next on here. Fortune's Run. I'm saving the best or the worst for last.
We got, we got it. Yeah! Okay. Let's, uh... How do I get out of here? There we go. What do you want? We got some, yeah, I got some salt. You don't want any problems? Okay. Alright. I won't give you any problems then. Yes, nicely. What's it? Is this place abandoned? Let's just say it's been repurposed. I can use my gamepad. I don't know if I really want to. I feel like, I feel like it's inappropriate to use my gamepad. So I'm just gonna... Well, you took your damn time. This is really necessary. You wouldn't think so, but the company has a staggering 60% operational failure rate at <laughs> Pick up the equipment and I'll roll out the terminal. Hey, sure. What's this? What do we got? Uh, Alright, let's get to it, Moz. I'm gonna be taking you through some simple exercises. Come on, do I really have to? I guess I could just give you your evaluation exam right away if you- mm, Well, yeah, that's pro- First up, let's practice jumps. You can press crouch while in the air. So, okay, now I want you to wall jump by pressing jump against the obstacle, then crouch jump to get clear of it. Nice, let's do some more wall jumping. Wall jumps can be performed twice in one jump. Use it to get across that large gap. see some hands, Mose. I want you to take down the- Be careful. Some en- <laughs> Not bad. You can also press kick to kick up when an enemy's balance reaches zero. They'll be knocked down for- Deep breath and clear your mind. You can press focus to activate focus. V? It'll slow down your perception of time. <laughs> focus doesn't last too long, but it'll give you the edge you need to execute more complex maneuvers. Remember to have some sugary food when you're done using focus, or you'll tire yourself out. Okay, this one's a little bit tricky. If you press fire, of course you'll need some kind of melee weapon if you're having a hard time. Well, that's unfortunate. Let's try that again. Okay. Right. Okay. Of well, that's unfortunate. Oh, that's gonna be okay. That's of course, if you're. Tricky. If you press fire, when of course you'll need some kind of melee weapon. If you're oh, I have to press. I've been pressing right now. So that 
wasn't too bad. Next one's real easy. You can press when you've got the... Sure. Okay. Great. Now let's talk about emergency. Uh. Pick up those bandages. Press P. You can right click the band. When it gets too rough, this is what you they might want to slip by the detective. If you crouch and move in the shadows at the head, you should be able to sneak by those guards easily. Oh, oh, oh god, oh god. Ah! One last thing, if you crouch... I got things to do. Let's get to work. All right. I'll just... You owe me. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, I forgot to... Shit. I should have done the final exam. Got scrapped from All right. Cyberpunk? That's Come on. Nice. I guess. You say I'm gonna. Whatever you say, hotshot. Oh, God. <laughs> you think? Hey, I didn't write the program. Again. Sure.
turn. Hey, hi. 
again. Sure. Also, Sunset Play Demo Vulcan Play Demo OpenGL. Okay, okay. Recommended for NVIDIA. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not good. Oh, no. What, do you, what, do you, what is this game doing? Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh no, no, oh. My stream's still going, right? Oh. All right, let me, let me see if I can fix this. Graphics. Oh, this is like Doom. I think it's in, I think it's actually in DZ Doom. Okay, well, no, uh, I tried to start Sunset, uh, what's it called, Beyond Sunset, and it, it got all, it got all wonky. Let me see if it... Sunset down. Is this not going to work? Okay, so the chances might not work. Oh, wait. Do we have something? We got something. Yeah, so this is very much a... A, a, a doom. Uh, this is. A, I'm. I'm pretty sure it's C. Doom. It's in G. G. Z. Doom. Oh God. Honestly, that other game might have also been. Same game as last time? No, it's it's a little different. Oh, I'll get close to a target. Oh. Oh, look at look at this. We got we got we got Doom. Got 2016 Doom kills. Oh, this is fucking. This is this is just this is just those Windows 98 mazes. Look, a lot of people are making retro FPSs these days. All right. <laughs>
<laughs> a lot of people got tired of cod. Oh god. Oh, fuck! <laughs> oh man, FPS platform is almost never... It's always rough. Supposed to go this way? No, it wasn't always garbage. It just kind of became that way. The bigger in file size it was, it became, the more garbage it became. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh, god. oh fuck! Oh my god. What a jump. Oh god, no, slow down. Oh god. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Thank you. No. Oh. Move. <laughs> oh. oh shit. I can't I can't handle all this. Games don't need to be over 16 gigabytes. Yeah, exactly. That's that. Tears of the Kingdom was like 16 gigabytes. I can't do any of that yet. 
speaking of FPS games. Oh, Trepang 2 is almost. Oh, that, that should be fun. Yeah, no, I've I've seen uh yeah, I've seen gameplay of Trepang. Alright. <laughs> Here we go. We're about to have, we're about to cause some problems. Derby Judero Judero. I don't know. I don't know how you pronounce it. Oh shit. Let me. Yeah, it looks cool. Here, many a foot sore weary mile we have walked Ju Juttero beyond the shepherd. Shepherd's Acre is the village of Braith Air on a bond where we may rest our head. I have no need for rest, man. Now, if they made this game by taking like little action figures and Digitally putting them in, in like this, that's pretty cool. Yonder, yonder Shepherd calls out. What's that? I want this. Oh. 
No evil. Oh yes, a staple of indie games, action figures. Oh, oh, you mean the bad music. have passed since your brain great Ron glosses braced these glens and you return not too soon. Something bothers my flock. A hideous beast plump with wickedness. Can you shoo it away? Judero, is that something you can do for me? I that I can. Here, a good deed. Judero, a good deed. Look at all these collectors. It's like Banjo Kazooie. And a cowardly one at that. That beast, that wicked beast, was only my dreams. I have not to give this passage through my fields. Here, mind you can walk in their boots. Oh shit. Oh shit. I kinda dig it. Go away! Has bested me through wit and well. Has, see, has he seen the last of me? Yes, yes he has. enough of that <laughs> that listen uh, that music's probably gonna get copyright and i'm gonna be so f fucking furious
This game's called Conquer Humanity. I, I guess it's... for video games. Better? I. Yeah. Dude, what if they, the hatred guys ended up making this? I didn't look at who made it. I just. You know, I was like, oh.
<laughs> that's stupid. Game's a bit too loud. Uh, yeah, that's fair. This is a stupid game. This is Night Order of the Alchemist. It's uh, it's a Metroidvania from the looks of it. Fixed compatibility issues. What does that mean? Oh. Okay. Oh. Well, that's unfortunate, but I can... It doesn't bother me if I can't use since this is just like a demo. Maybe they'll get it fixed. I promise you I've saved the best for last. Or the worst. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, what's going on here? Tell me what happened here. I don't know. It happened so suddenly. Dozens of demons arrived. Everything turned into chaos. You have to help me. They took my wife and daughter. Demons don't act like that. Unless... Did you see some people wearing masks? Yes, I saw several. Please find my family. I heard Willem say something about looking for an important document in the governor's building. I see. We'll take care of this. I'm just going to skip this. I want to... Let's go to the main menu. Order the screen. There we go. Skip this stuff. Just like, uh, hey, very cool. Nope, it 
doesn't let me. Okay. So, this this game's background is way too fucking bad. May, what, what they should have done is maybe they should have done what what uh, Harmony and Dissonance did and give the character like a blue outline. Because in, in the GBA Castlevania games, like for a Circle of the Moon, everyone's biggest criticism was that uh, it, they couldn't see Nathan or Nathan something or other. I can't remember his name. So for, for just a B Belmont, they uh, they gave him like a blue aura, and then they kind of just uh, fixed that again by giving Soma like a, a brighter uh, color palette for uh, Aria of Sorrow. around with, uh, I don't want to mess around with, like, the gamepad stuff right now. So we'll try that again at some other point. What's Lords of Exile? Oh, Lords of Exile was the other one. Maybe maybe this one will be gamepad friendly. Oh no, my gamepad's off. That's the problem. Oh, I guess I can't skip it. Are you serious? It's just like in, uh, uh, Dracula X, um, uh, what's it called? Rondo of Blood. Yeah. It's not a game I've played a lot of. i played way more. Ooh. So the rumors are true, Gabriel, the bloodthirsty of, of Exilia, has come here in search of revenge. I admire your bravery, and through 
All that remains of me is the memory of fallen warriors consumed by the flames. I will do what I can to help you. You will find me in piles of bones like this. I'll be watching you. Damn, Shovel Knight looking kind of different, Kappa. <laughs> oh, I can, and then I slide, right, right. Yeah, I think it, uh, I know, I see what you mean. Nah, it, it's more like Castlevania. They went, they went with classic Castlevania movement speed. There we go. Oh, well, that's cool. And this music's a banger. If you have enough gold, you can bet it. Can... Alright. Ah, damn. Okay. <laughs> Oh no, don't worry, the cringe will be coming soon. Alright. What am I supposed to do here?
It's not that Kusogi. It's just slow. Oh. Evil lurks in this wood. I've seen many pass yonder, but none return alive. Oh, thank you. Let's just finish this, and then we will get. Oh God. Oh, you, you know, uh, it's a, it's a, it's a visual novel, an animated visual novel. Oh, fuck, you're... What? What? <laughs> wow. Oh, that's that's a mean fuck you at the end. That's okay. I, I, I understand. I understand this boss now. Oku probably knows. Alright, let's let's try this again. Yo, that's cool! Oh wow, that's really cool. It's like uh it's it's like Shinobi 3. All right, I think it's time. I think it's time. Enough, enough bullshitting. Wait a second. No, you gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> Ogu, Ogu, the de the demo's already got another fucking update. I think, oh, did they, oh, <laughs> no. Did they accidentally release the full game?
I wasn't really planning on playing that long anyways. Uh, someone said, uh, <laughs> uh, they want to know why the Discord's so gatekept. I wanted to join with a mate to see progress of the game and interact with it and the devs in the community about this game, but we were banned for bad fit and trolling before we could even join. We just wanted to know more about this project and how the community views the project, but again, we were banned without any further justification. We'd like some further explanation from someone who actually has stake in the social media slash game. Thank you for your interest in the game. We had to move an application-based process for, for Discord due to some really severe hate raids and attacks on our Discord community, which you want to be a safe space for everyone involved. And sometimes that means we are cautious with people joining the Discord. If I had to explain why someone, why too much publicity can hurt a project, I would put this game as an example. It stood out as a sore thumb during the PS5 presentation, and as people discovered more about the game, things got gradually worse. Getting a parody game made before your title even released it. <laughs> what do you mean parody game? What are you talking about? We're gonna we're gonna bully. Listen, we're gonna we're gonna bully this game. We're gonna but we're gonna use the right pronouns so that they can't get us on anything. Why tell lies so easy to disprove? Uh, hang on. I listen. Yes, I will. As soon as the fucking update, they they have an update for the demo. They have an update for the demo, Jess, and I don't know why. It's it's like eighty two percent. It's almost done. Any sane dev? All right, because I I had to explain some getting a parody game made before your title even releases is also a punch in the gut. Uh, I think the best move from Goodbye Volcano High would be to distance itself from Kotaku, place a gigantic middle finger between the game and those few articles about it. They don't make you look better, and the only thing worse would be getting the praise of someone in the likes of Jim Sterling. Because the game had a fan game made of it during the development by a bunch of people on 4chan who loved the designs but assumed the writers would waste the potential, the fan game started out as an outright parody but turned into a genuine labor of love by the people working on it, and thus brought more attention to the series. And the main guy behind the project is moving on to make his own from scratch dino and other lizard adjacent VNs due to all the positive reception his work got. By the way, uh, I wanna hug a what's it called? I'm gonna I'm gonna shill I'm gonna shill the fuck out of that guy's game right now. I want to hug that gator. We're shout outs to that guy. Oh, his demo's available for download. I might have to uh I might have to play that as a palate cleanser at some point. How long until goodball <laughs> goodbye volcano hot goodbye volcano manor has has not safe for work parody um who knows uh did, I, did it download oh okay it's complete good 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 all right <laughs> all right garbage here we go Start. This demo requires a controller. This is a pre-release demo. Bugs are expected. Uh, I'm sure. Uh, well, well, bug. I'm sure bug chasers are really happy for for that. In Goodbye Volcano High, your choices will influence the relationships you have with other characters. New content may unlock depending on your decisions. Got it. When you make a choice that might have changed your relationship with a character, you'll see this icon in the corner of your screen. Cool, cool. 
No pressure. See you at school. Fuck you. There's... All right, here's the sound. Scientists announced today the discovery of a previously unobserved asteroid, estimated to be roughly 10 kilometers in diameter. Designated CO103, uh, the object shows it. a rather Oops. high possibility of entering the solar system and a non-insignificant chance of collision with the planet. Astronomers were quick to add that very little is known about the orbit and speed of the asteroid in these early stages. And trajectory predictions How are very likely are gonna... to change as more data is... That's right, Mary. Though we know very little, the, scientists say the, the asteroid's the electromagnetic atmosphere may cause some minor interference with electronics. And we'll be right back after this commercial break. Yo, Naomi was right. Largest asteroid ever to hit Earth twice as big as rock. Anyways, asteroid takes us all out. Best way to go, in my opinion, I'm sure. Come at me, Meteor. You sold out fast? Well, I love living in a historically... In <sighs> Fuck you. Fuck you! These guys suck. I hate them. It does have voice acting. Hey, Fang, I have to tell you something. I like you. Cool. All right. I, I, know, I know this is weird because you don't know who I am, but you will. <laughs> what a f what a fuck. Dude, d like, who thinks that's a, that's psycho behavior to do that, to do that, like, from an, from an unknown call? Uh, what? I'm gonna text back. Wait, why? I'm gonna text back. Uh... Calm down, weirdo. I guess I can't choose that one now. I hate all these people. Which one of you was it? <laughs> the energy is wild right now. Ooh, I don't. And they won't say. I'm pretty sure you could easily trace that fucking phone number. Like, just Google it. Does Google exist in this world? Cell phones do. I'm gonna drive away on my tokusatsu bike. I'm gonna say people are weird. That, that's, that's true. There, people are strange. People are weird. People respond to things weirdly. 
I should check in with the band. People can react to things. Really, really though, I think about the proper answer would have been people are the best. Wait, I'm sorry, what? Brain? Uh... Peach? Are you- are you- are you- are you squirting- is your vagina squirting stardust? Is that what's going on? What's the internet say? Oh. Everybody's just like, oh, by the way, this is happening. Good one. No fucking way. Watch some fucking rats survive the asteroid and end up giving the planet to the mammals. Ha ah, ha ha ha. There gotta be some billionaire out there with money to burn and too many missiles in his basement. What the fuck? This camp is better virgin. This is happening because God hates carnivores. <laughs> I knew this retrograde was going. Man, no, and not a single slur in any of the tweets. That's how you know it's not real. Yeah, you got to move around. That's what I would do. Who's this? Who's this loser? Hey, you, um, hear the news? Yeah, I did. Yeah, people are freaking out. But no one really knows anything yet. It's probably nothing. Tell that to Naomi. She's been texting me asteroid facts, and they are high-octane nightmare fuel. Sounds like Naomi. You know every fact she sends me has been cross-checked with at least three verified sources. Yeah, I'm sure. Kinda hard I'm to sure dismiss. She got all her sources from Kotaku. Let me hear some. Well, let's start with the tidal waves. Because those would happen. Plural. Then, ironically, would come the fires. Also plural. Yeah? Okay. Got it. Good thing it's not gonna hit us, then. But no one knows that. Seriously, it's not. It's not scary, it's just dumb and annoying. Yeah? Yeah, no, you're right. Thanks. It's just, what if it's real, you know? Now what if it is real? Who gives a shit? <laughs> you staying up? Nah, I think I'm just gonna get some tea and go to bed. What if it is real? Why don't you just, you know... Hunker down. It's gonna be fine. Girl, it's take your year. fucking jeans Just off. Just gonna make it to the summer tour. Who sleeps in their jeans? Unless you're drunk. That's happened to me once. And communities all across the continent reacted to the news of a previously unknown space object this morning. Let's turn that radio up. No, turn. Oh, this is bad for him. Damn, enough about the asteroid. Yeah, that's a good call. I might be obsessing. When did you start listening to Pangea this morning? I thought the goal is to not turn into dad. Uh, I have my own reasons to stay informed. I'm on the debate team, uh, and dad could never oh, pull sorry. off this outfit that I'm totally crushing. Shut up. The silence yeah, is yeah, that silence was perfect. Definitely not. Except you have something to say. No. No. Well, hey, hey, could I run something by you? All right. Fine. So today, big day, class president's speech at the assembly. In light of the whole space no, they all rock, wanted to be a part of this. This is their best. Of this is their Asian thing. My chosen theme feels off. What's the theme? Using this year to, um, make an impact. Uh huh. <laughs> and? Oh. Right. Impact. I used it 542 times in a 1,000 word speech. I even had a section where I rhymed every sentence with impact. Fucking dummy. 
That's what Seriously. I would say. Let it go. No, I have to change it. Yeah, it's just too weird. Can I run some ideas by you? Please help me. Yes. Let's let's hear all your fine. Let's hear you all got? your stupid okay, ideas. So, this year I want us to burn bright. Shit. To streak across the sky like flaming trails of potential. This guy's ready dumb. to vaporize our obstacles this guy's... upon entry. Yeah, you know what? You're great. You're gonna you're gonna nail it, yeah. kid. Perfect. Go with that. Wait, really? It's gonna be out of this world. Yeah. Wow. I'm gonna fucking tank his career right? right now. I can't tell if I'm proud or scared. Good session. Seriously, please. You're so comfortable on stage, and I don't know how you do it. And I want to be that way. Okay. Here's what I'd suggest. You've got to... Make people laugh. Make people laugh. If that means cracking a few jokes about our impending doom, so be it. What if nobody gets it? Then they're stupid. Yeah, you might have to be ready for that. But it's still worth trying. Thank you. You give pretty good advice His sometimes. His name's Nazer. Wow, I have never been to school this early. You mean on time? Oh, well, good luck today. Thanks. And you'll be there. I'll just focus on you and the audience. <laughs> yeah. Assembly? I can't remember the last time I actually went to that. See? It'll be a fun new thing for you. Don't. Plus, you'll get all the hot intel on Senior Picture Day. Woohoo! I am. I'm going to destroy his career before it starts. What are you doing here? You being up this early feels... wrong. Wait, blink twice if you're a mimic. <laughs> new year, new me. Yeah? Okay, but if you join debate club or something, I'm getting you some help. Hmm. I hate all Fair. these guys. Nerds. Losers. Okay, okay, everybody. Lots of assembly energy happening right now. I kind of like it. Oh, you. are they still doing that? Yeah. I don't know. The whole apocalypse thing really puts talking about Pizza Fridays in a different light. Hey, fuck you. I love pizza. I was just going to go chill on the roof. You are obsessed with going up there. You're above and inside, on the outside. What? It's awesome. Is there an option to just, like, I hate you? Can I just, can I just tank? I'm going to ruin every single relationship I have. Who? Um. LJ thinks we have talent. Gosh, you think she could write a nice text for once? Um, uh, what should I say back? I mean, that will be there? Wait, there's a gif I think is perfect. Ah, uh, not helpful. Grateful. I think this means she's rooting for us? We're gonna get in? Or she's telling us not to get our hopes up. Nice hands. No way. She wouldn't bother with that. Ugh. Emergency band meeting. We need a plan for the audition. So, meeting on the roof? <sighs> no. Oh my gosh, get over the roof. Perfect, let's go. Wait a minute, don't we have like a week till the audition? Exactly. You're gonna love the view up there. It's always the same. They all they always want to be in bands, and they think they got musical talent, and then they want to be artists, and then they want to be game designers. Wow. Yeah, this is. And they want to make games great. where they shove right. their fursonas in, and, but their fursonas are all scalies. <laughs> no thanks. I quit. My voice. 
Anyway. I'm gonna make your voice Bad sound news. hotter. About the giant rock that's gonna kill us all? No. Yeah. We heard. We need new songs for the audition. Yeah. Seriously though, I got like no sleep thanks to the news. Oh, well, the tough titties. What if it's real? I mean, it's probably definitely it, real. You're right. He sounds so, like he's closer. Like it could be just as bad as people are saying. They never even tell us if we were all toast. Right? What if everything we're doing is for nothing? I just spent hours on homework when I could have been, I don't know. The seat girl had the exact same setting thing. for this? Oh. I'm not too worried. And we can still win Battle of the Bands, asteroid or not. Really? Should we even practice at a time like this? Bochi, the or should we throw out the shackles of capitalism better. and bound into oh, a life I of freedom? Oh, I fucking hate you, bitch! Shut up! Fuck off! Hell yeah! Can Trish. I tell her to jump off the Let's fucking the roof right now? Thanks. Which, again, is why we're up here. I'm gonna to be. Talk about the you want to throw off the shackles of capitalism? So be, Everyone what, should pirate this game That's when it comes lot, out. Dude. That's a lot. That's how you throw the shackles off. Have this project Pirate this game. It's already happening in calculus. Plus if anyone even Tokyo. bothers putting it on torrent today. sites. I didn't even hear what she said. Please, guys, there's no worm drama without you. Is that their this band is name? The only way to win. What if the real winning? Shut up! Was running away. <laughs> no. Okay. Ooh. Let's just play an old song in, like, a new way. Ugh, they're so embarrassing. Wow, okay, sorry. Yikes. Yeah, tell them. Rude. Yeah, our songs are no, crins and cringe like and that. shit. Our old songs are shit. Water we gotta make new ones. Things now. Our old stuff is about big things. But you could change some of it, I guess. Let's change Works all of it. Let us know when you're done. Well, maybe we can all pick one at lunch. Sure, sure. I gotta go. To my locker, but in a shady way. Because I have a terrible secret today. What's your ter- that, oh boy. that you're menstruating? Was I weird? No, I wasn't weird. I was Trish completely was normal. being weird, right? Before? I don't know. Was she? Uh, are you okay? You've come into this year kind of intense with the band stuff. What's up? I'm fine. Nothing. Right. You're being totally chill and normal right now. Fine. The band is important. Why did she have to just leave? I said it was an emergency. Who, you did? Who left? And it is. To you. Who left? <sighs> so I was being weird. Shit. Sorry, I just... It feels like we really have a chance. At what? I bet this would be a good spot to be if it hits. The asteroid? I'd rather not spend my last moments at school, actually. It's weird how everyone's acting like nothing is different. Yo, his mouth didn't like move when me, it was everything in the back. Feels different now. Even though it's just a maybe? Yeah, I don't know. It's like once something may or may not happen, you can't stop thinking about it. And that's like the rest of my life all of a sudden. We're going on tour with the band. You, me, Trish, a van with our name on the side. Nothing has changed. <laughs> the van would be pretty sick. No, it wouldn't. So, you know how we all play Legends and Lore, right? No, I don't play... An ITM? Yeah. Oh. I'm joining this weekend, right? Okay. You are. Yes. All right. Anyway, I've been playing LNL since I was like eight years old. Yeah. I know the game better than anyone in this whole school. Okay. Uh, it sucks when the people you want to share it with aren't as interested. So. Yeah, you know what else sucks when the it. Pinkertons but I don't break the door down to somebody's house because an LNL adjacent game. Uh, <laughs> they had the leaks to an LNL adjacent game called uh, Sorcery the the Assembly Ing. I'm sure. I'm sure the LNL creators are all about Time that. Time to assemble. Shut up, bitch. Good luck with that. 
catch me up on whatever I miss. About the yearbook dance or whatever. You're not coming? <laughs> no. No, neither I. I gotta do some invoicing and smell and L planning. You wanna ditch with me? No. Well, Trish isn't there, so. So what are you doing now? Oh, oh, I have to I have to look at these people. Um uh what do they want me to look at? Who's that? Joy Buck says they try to spin the asteroid into some motivational speech about their dreams. <sighs> um, before the meteor hits and we all die, anyone admit they have a crush on me? New video just uploaded my first day of school prep plus OOTD plus my tips for making the most a senior year link here YouTube Dee's always hustling I wouldn't be surprised if she hatched from her egg with a five-step business plan I heard some shit went down at volleyball practice last night What went down? This Friday defending our house payoffs or nothing Every year, Chris posts like he's on the football team, even though he very obviously isn't. New school, new year, new me, and new enemies. Watch your back. Abby is very cool, and I hope I never, ever get on her bad side. Oh, my God. The new Swamp Babies single is so good. Ah. Uh, what? Ah. Cross-country tryouts after school. Open to all levels of experience. Don't miss out. She's nice, but it should be illegal to be a morning person in high school. It'd be illegal to be a morning person, period. Uh, Mark's fun, but I don't know if you, we've ever talked in real life. He tends to be asleep during daylight. No, you stayed up last night playing the latest Deity of Carnage game. I was crying about a father and son and their dead puppy. What do you mean they're the same? <sighs> Nothing I hate more than being 20 minutes late for class and seeing some flying dinosaur soaring above me. What the fuck does that mean? No, I'm buying it. Oh, oh, I'm sure. I'm sure. L listen, it's the funny meme. Yeah, I'm. I'm sure you're gonna be in solidarity with them when shit hits the fan. I'm sure you're not gonna throw them under the bus the first chance you get. Who's that? Who's that whore? Are you gonna go in or? Um. I'm gonna stay. No, I'm fine here. Makes perfect sense. Who's that bitch? Yeah. Look at. He still looks nervous. I don't know why he's so into this. I wish this became our generation's E.T. Yes! And... Yeah. Hi! I'm Naomi, and I'm here to remind you that the yearbook club is still looking for members. I know I want to remember this year forever. So you can join and be part of making our memories last a lifetime through good design. And speaking of your book, don't forget senior pictures are coming up. Oh, wow. Um, uh, so some good tips for taking good photos can be found on the yearbook club website at... Okay. Well, uh, okay. Thanks. What? What? That's the kind of memory that'll follow you to the grave. I guess. We, need, we, we do don't want to miss us. A as in each other. Shut up, Nathan. It's not about the rock that might hit us. Even though it definitely probably won't. Oh, fuck come off. come on. 
I can't be the only one kind of hoping it does. Nay, sir! Can't be more brutal than finals, right? What are you doing? Oh, Not bad. Oh my god! Oh, I guess it worked. Almost there, buddy. In conclusion, maybe the rock will hit us, and maybe probably it won't. But either way, we will still have each other. Kind of. Okay, and that's my perfectly crafted plug for the big dance. Ugh. So, end of the year, mark your calendars, prep your moves. That's it I... for me. You've been great, Volcano High. Please don't post any videos of this, like, anywhere ever. Thanks. You know it's going everywhere. It's going everywhere. It's being posted all over. Is that it? I guess that was it. That was that was great. <laughs> that was shit. I will I will be sure to pirate this game and stream it when it comes out. And then I'll, and then I'll play Snoot game. Well, hang on. Did I want to? Did I want to hug that gator? Actually, just come out. Did the demo just come out? The, of course, the VAs did it at their own homes. It, it, it was COVID. That's why they did it at their own homes. And then it got delayed a bunch. And then, and then Snoot Game came out and blew them the fuck out. And they got so ass blasted that they realized that if they just release a normal visual novel, everyone's going to laugh at them. So they have to make it animated in order to compete with Snoot Game. And thank God. I better cleanse your appetite. You mean your, pa your palate? Yes. Uh, hang on, I can fix that. I'm not going to play the better version, but I will play the sequel to the better version. In, in like two, in, in a minute. Okay, how do I quit out of this game? How do I quit out of this shit? See you at school. Thank you. That's a shit demo, but whatever. There we go. <laughs> oh, the Fortunes Runs demo also just got an update. All right, here we go. Oh my god. Already. Already they're trying to... No pressure, see you at the torrent site. Alright, what do we got? Let's roll back side. Naughty stuff. Uh, disable loot images. Listen, we don't we don't need. Oh, the mods! There's gonna be mods for this game. September 4th. Yeah? Year? Oh, Jesus. 
Amid the arid heat of the morning sun of Valcadera Bluff, I can't help but miss living in the more temperate weather of the Midwest. Suspiciously wealthy furries. Summer sleeves are in style this year. Yeah, all the furries that are in the military for whatever reason and have a lot of disposable income. That jacket's aroma blog better be right. This suede thing is killing me. VN with mod support. Well, at least it's guaranteed to start getting chillier in a few weeks. Besides, I'm sure to make an impression with this. Amber Crombie and Flint is all the rage these days. Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, you know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe right side is fine. I can fix that. Oh, shit. No. There we go. I sigh and lean back in the hard plastic seating of the metro. I'm on my way to my first day in a new school. Ordinarily, I'd just be glued to my phone on this trip, but there's just too much on my mind right now. My folks' sitch requires us to move frequently, which gives me little time to fit in. Much like how a Rolling Stone gathers no moss, I, I could never make a friend I'd keep for longer than a year. Just a lot of promises to keep in touch that peter off within months. Admittedly, it's my fault in the end, but that's all going to change, starting today. I'm going to see you now. It's my very last chance to prepare. Luckily for me, the cards are stacked in my favor. Why? I feel around my backpack for my DSLR, so my fingers can absentmindedly fiddle with the mode dial. St. Hammond High School is extremely well known for their artist curriculum. In other words, I'll be surrounded by people that share my interests, even if it's a bit of a ride away. Speaking of rides, I was hoping that my parents could drive me there today. By the time I was up there, they already left for work. No big deal. I like the hustle and bustle of public transportation. I imagine I'm going to have to get used to this anyways. As time passes, my mind wanders to memories of the previous schools. They all sucked. The train car gradually comes to a stop, and the sign indicates that this is where I get off. I step off the metro, climbing out of the station as I follow a few other students heading towards the school. Oddly enough, I'm only seeing dinosaur students, not another human to be seen anywhere. Must be one of those dino-heavy regions. There's a lot of greenery here as well. You'd almost forget how close we are to, to a major city. The pathway leads to a stone bridge that goes over a small creek. As I walk across, I notice other students meet in pairs and walk with each other. The air begins to fill with the sounds of laughter and stories of their summer break. Yeah? Yo, that background looked really nice. St. Hammond High, my new home, away from home for the next year. I stopped to take a deep breath. The air here is crisp, reminding me of an old campground I went to back in elementary school. Once again, I'm handed an opportunity to make something of myself. I'm apprehensive, but hopeful. It's my last shot. This is no going back. I take my first step onwards. Here we go again. When's, when's the gator? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. If Cavemanon could do, like, he's almost at the level that Goodbye Volcano High is at. By the way, uh, <laughs> I just want to point out, he was able to release the demo of this game and Snoot Game before Goodbye Volcano High ever came out. And while... And while half of them regret it from what I've read, there's still plenty of that made it. It's also the management's claim to fame. The facade on the front entrance being dominated by a vibrant mural. I got a good feeling about this place. Yeah, I'm sure they do. Some friends whisper to each other. I just knew this jacket would pay <laughs> Yo, I, I admire his confidence. Front doors are propped wide open. I already feel the cool breeze inviting me in. Inside, it's a familiar yet brand new sight. I hadn't mentioned it yet, but this school is also unique for its student body. It's composed almost entirely of di dinosaurs, all manner of saurian herbivores and otherwise. Look at these bros. Scales, feathers, tails, is that a tether? Wings, talons, and webbed hands, not to even mention their colors. 
All vibrant enough to challenge the bright murals on the school outside. Yo, who's she? Dozens of students march about, reconnecting with past friends and meeting new ones. Some anxiously glance at their schedules, checking every door as though they were numbered at random. I probably shouldn't be standing here stare. Whoa, is that a human? Whoa. I'm soon surrounded and overrun by a crowd of neon colored teenagers. Clearly my jacket's working like a charm. Yeah, you tell him, Anon. Wow, he's like a life-size mannequin. Hey, new kid. I'm instantly sworn by the crowd. Is, is this what it's like to be popular? I really wasn't expecting it to happen this quickly. A few students are taking pictures with their phones. I even see some sketchbook and pens in hand rapidly scribbling on pages. Wow, a human. Are you like a foreign exchange student? In the chaos, I feel a few people touch my, ew. Whoa, human skin feels weird. Geez, a bit uncalled for. But I guess I don't want to be a party pooper. A few more people shout at me to get my attention. Hey, could you look over here for a side profile? Oh man, yeah, this will be a good reference material. Wait, wait, I need to get a better look at his skin texture. <laughs> Once again, I found myself frozen, only muttering quietly as I hastily try to follow their instructions. Eventually, the Saurians take all their photos and talk themselves out before dispersing back to their own friend groups. By the time I recover from the shock of the situation, the last one breaks off and I find myself seemingly all alone again. Oh, that was my chance to socialize. I blew it! I'm your human, right? A Triceratops girl leans forward, scanning me up and down. If only he had a pompadour, he would be set for life. Dude, if he had a pompadour, he could fit right in. It'd basically be like a dinosaur head. Uh, yeah, close enough. Hey, can I, like, get a selfie with you? It'd be great for one of my classes. Yeah, definitely. Oh, uh, oh, you cool. Yeah, anyways, I gotta go. Oh. And go. What's the photo for, by the way? My fashion design class. That jacket is ballin'. So it is. Thanks for the pick, Han. Well. But there's no way I've already blown it. I try to shake away the negative thoughts, focus on the positive. For a brief moment, I was the talk of the school. Yeah! That familiar sound draws my attention. I know what that is. There's someone kneeling, and with one of the latest camera models, if I'm not mistaken. Hey! The guy flinches. I flinch too. I hadn't meant to shout at him. The few students around me don't bat an eye at it, though. Oh, it's the gay dino. I'm sorry about the yell. No, it's fine. I managed to get the shot I wanted. The bespeckled boy, I think he's a parasaur, double checks the camera's display and smiles. Yep, perfect. This will be this will be a fine print for the yearbook. Can I see? Oh. And dark. What do you have your F stop set at? Ah shit. I'm taking it as an elective. With Mr. Ladikin. Thinking back to my memorized class schedule, the name does sound familiar. Yep. Oh snap, cool, we'll be classmates. Mr. Ladikin's busy, he just teaches it for one period. He offers his hand out for a handshake. I'm Ben. Inko. Friend achieved. I'm actually new here. Kind of figured being the only human student this year and all. St. Hammond isn't one of the more popular schools, but the staff put a lot of effort in the arts programs. Even the campus itself is designed like a living art piece if you ever need help. I wouldn't say no to a tour. A tour, you say? Well, I'm only going back to the principal's office, but I can point out some neat stuff along the way. Yeah, go to the principal's office. Let's go. Oh. Okay. That's neat. And there's all his extra lenses, lenses in the bag. I feel absolute elation. I finally know someone that's into photography, and I really want to approach it, but Ben fills the air between us talking more about the school. Which is why we still go by the feather tails, even though it's a tad distasteful. What? 
<laughs> what? Dang, you're pretty good at this. Do you give these tours to all the new students? Not really, although it is something I put thought about a lot. Hey, Lunara. Ben goes to greet students, putting up some intricate wall banners. Hey, her ass is sticking out of that dress. Oh, hey, Ben. You have a good summer vacation? I did great work on the decorations. They look even better. Ah, thank you. What's all this for? She steps aside so I can fully view the banner she just finished with. The Cultural Arts Club. We meet every Thursday after school and look at antique artwork. She'd initially looked past me to talk with Ben, but she gasped when she realized, Hey, you're a human, right? Oh, that's a silly question. You should totally join. I just love human culture. <laughs> There's an amazing set of ancient masks at my place from ancient Europe. I just adore them. Well, wow, that's impressive. I think you'd make a good curator. You know what? I probably would. After that club display during Spirit Week last year, I gotta agree. We took weeks studying that tribe, weeks more practicing those dances. We also study and paint with those styles, like we're learning techniques of the old masters. Hopefully soon we can get into sculpting like those old Venus statues. We plan on getting one to look at sometime this year. What do you think? It'd be great if you could come. Sorry, I was grabbing water. Hey, that'd be neat. What, what say you, Inko? Maybe I do love culture. Oh, that's great. Oh, listen, we have this old chieftain's dress we've had for ages. We just have to see what it looks like on... Oh, God. I'll think about it. Was that, a, was that an Eva reference? Well, hey, nice to catch up, Lunara. We got places to be. Take care. Bye! She waves us off, and Ben continues leading me to the principal's office. Hey, Ben. Oh, hey, Michael, listen. Can't talk now, but I'd love to catch up later. I'm floored. This guy seems to know just about everyone in school as much as they know him. Talk about being on top of things. He points out a few more minor landmarks in the school and stops to greet a number of students happy to see him after the summer break. And sorry for having to stop so much. No way, I think it's cool you know everyone. If only I could be cool without making us late. He points out a few more minor landmarks in the school, eventually leading me to its biggest draw. Just outside the administrative office, the hallway is filled with wonderful pieces of work. Paintings line the walls with name placards beneath detailing who the artists were. All alumni from the school. And this is the gala. All of these pieces have been featured in all kinds of articles. Oh, well, I guess this is a real dino crisis we have going on. Um, I'd, I'd commend them for that. I'll be really mad if, uh, what's that? What's that Capcom game? If they never, if, if, uh, that Capcom game makes me sad that it's not Dino Crisis, and they tease us with that girl that looks like Regina. I know, right? One moment. Ben turns to the nearest door and gives it a polite knock. Who is it? It's, it's me, Principal Scaler. It's, er, it's me, Principal Scaler. An Ovi wrapped in older than her mid-30s exits the room, holding a steaming mug and sporting a tire. It's... Mommy? Good morning, Benjamin. Good morning. This is our esteemed principal. Good morning, ma'am. What? Oh, I hadn't noticed. You would be Mr. Ganito. Oh, his name is Inko Ganito. Ah, uh, that's like a non, right? I'm so happy you've chosen our school for your last year, Mr. Nidu. Ben be, ben, be sure to give him a thorough St. Hammond welcome. I already was. If you ever need any assistance, my office is always open, Mr. Neto. Not to mention, the student council is also available for help. Isn't that right, Ben? Yes, Principal Scaler. Thank you, Principal Scaler. Oh, and Ben, a moment, please. But... What? Are they fucking? Are they fucking? Is that what's going on? 
Well, I could practically use this thing as a map with how detailed it is. No wonder it's hanging so predominantly by the principal's office. This gentle brushstrokes, the vibrant colors, the evening sun bouncing off each of the windows, and the majestic scarlet sky enveloping the horizon. All of which combine together to give a dreamscape feeling like it's an idealized vision of the city. It's beautiful. I've never seen a big I've never been a big admirer of paintings, but I can't deny that this is a masterpiece. Only a teacher could have been able to express the scenic beauty of the city with this level of skill and passion. Oh, he's a photographer. Oh, Halford, ninth grade, first place. A freshman did this, geez. Not even one photo. Hey, Inko, I'm back. Inko? What's that sound? Oh. Hey, watch it, jackass! Slow your roll, leather face! My leg! I watch as the perpetrator, aggressor, aggregator finally rounds the corner and comes barreling down the hallway. Yeah! Yeah, it's her! Yeah! Oh, shit. Green scales, messy hair, and a faded purple hoodie. She propels herself forward with dexterous hands, spinning the large wheels on her. I only now notice she's in a wheelchair. I didn't even know you could go that fast in one of those. What a theme song. She glances my way, her pupils lock on the mine. Her gray and gold eyes are marred by bags like she hasn't slept in days. The girl's entire presence is ghost-like. And that expression, it's like she's looking straight through me. I'm sure she barely registers my existence, but I don't think I'll ever forget that face. Yo, <laughs> she's really cool. She's really cool. Oof. Hey, watch it. Whoops. The parasol's hand rose over the display carefully, his eyes filled with worry. You looking for something? Cracks. Usually when another student falls into them, there's some kind of crack or scratch. Guess it's just a diner thing. You humans are lucky you don't gotta sweat over this kind of stuff. Yeah, it, uh, there's a lot of scenes that are animated better than uh, Volcano High. Often enough to drain school funds and repairs. That can't be good. Well, not to brag, but I make... The vibrato chime echoes through the now empty hall. I freeze. Party on the first day. Ha! Whoops. Sorry to run on like that. You should get going to your first class. Well, I need a tardy slip or something? Nah, it's the first day. Teachers are lenient. I'm fine either way, since, you know, one of the benefits of being class prez. What's your first period, phys ed? Ben sucks the air in through his teeth in a prolonged wince. You'll be fine. Gymnasium's down that away. Don't, uh, keep him waiting too long. I need to get going, too. Keep who waiting? I gotta go bye! Whoa, he walks fast when he has somewhere to be. That reaction doesn't exactly instill confidence in me. I follow Ben's directions towards school gymnasium. After all the earlier commotions, the first quiet moment to myself. Might as well take it to finally sort my thoughts. Let's see, what do I think th of this place so far? It's certainly livelier than any of the other schools I've been to. Ever since I've stepped foot in here, everything has been so lively and everyone seems so exuberant. It makes me feel a little out of my depth. I'm so used to the opposite. Here people like that girl earlier are eager, eager to share their hobbies almost without being prompted. That's, that's some, that's some grade A autism. Everyone's, everyone's on some level of the spectrum in this school and they're so eager to share their hobbies with, with you. Honestly, I could love it or hate it. Because I want to share, you know, I like sharing my hobbies. This school's art program attracts people. The students here don't have to be here. They're choosing to be here. That's why it's so active. Well, all right. What can I do with this information? 
It means I can probably be friends with anyone I want, right? Weird to say, but with everyone here sort of working with each other, there's bound to be an insane level of camaraderie, too. Maybe I won't even have to try. I'm almost at the gymnasium now, though, so I'll hold this thought for later. Ah, gym class, where the boys are separated from the men, and where people with Herculean physiques are able to show off their sculpted bodies. I begin to remember how much I dreaded going to PE. The innumerable bad experiences from past schools pale in comparison to the many skidded knees and broken glasses. Hopefully this school's PE is a lot less grueling. You There's dinosaurs! It's not gonna be grueling, Inko! It's not gonna- it's not gonna be better. This looks like the... gym class. <laughs> this looks like- <laughs> this almost looks like the 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 one the class Kenny versus Spenny basketball coach Oh fuck That was a warning shot. Yeah, look at this dude. No, this is no well, son. I have a policy. Each of my platoons get one free miss for me a year. And you just spent it. I shift my eyes to the students lined up next to him and they're so stiff with fear that I can't tell what they're feeling. You got three seconds to lay it on the front of your squadron. Why in the great name of Cavi Drockett are you late? A.V. Drockett? Well, I... He didn't even move. Hint taken, I shut my mouth. The Simeon Scholar starts marching back and forth like a drill sergeant. Listen up, because I'm only saying this once. In this class, we operate on tough love. We learn from our mistakes, so you better pray to Raptor Jesus you don't forget them. Because if you do... With three monstrous steps, the coach closed the distance of 10 yards to tower over me. I will be very upset! It, it reflects poorly on all of us, and that is not something I will accept. So I would love to see you maggots succeed, but if you don't, I'll make it unforgettable. And I understood. My high school experience was a blank space. I didn't keep in touch with anyone from there. I remember one time they wanted to organize a mini anime convention, but once the principal learned they wanted to have a yaoi panel, he vetoed the whole thing. <laughs> oh man. Yo, anime clubs in in high school and in college, they were never good. They always ended in disaster. It was such a fucking disorganized mess. Fan freaking tastic! Now then join the rest of your ranks and stiffen up! One second from my bladder's intact, I shuffle over to where my colleagues stand. I feel them staring at me with anger like I'm responsible for the coach's teaching style. What an appalling first impression to make. I should just quit and start over somewhere else while I still can. The teacher takes a second to glance over us, reminding himself of where he was before I had interrupted. <laughs> a ten hunt maggots! You will all drop and give me 20 of the finest push-ups. Those guts best be an ant's fart off that pristine gym floor or else. And then he blows the whistle. The violently loud blow of his whistle. The couch also takes the coach couch. Oh, well, it's the demo. He, uh, uh, Caveman on will fix the, the spelling later. Also takes his position to show the proper technique. I hide my wind as my knees impact roughly on the ground. The real pain starts as I try to keep pace with everyone around me. My biceps and forearms threaten to splinter from the weight of my body and the speed of my jerky movements. I never realized just how badly out of shape I was. On your feet, you bipedal slugs. This guy, he ain't human. Some kind of primate, maybe? A close relative? No shit! Now, since it's only the first day of school, how about we have ourselves a good old game of dodgeball? Did you say dodgeball? Oh yeah, dodgeball time. I'm sure I might need a shower after this. I really don't want to play dodgeball. Aren't we lucky? First day of school, we get to play a game. I I don't I don't do dodgeball. Why not? 
I, uh, I'm not exactly. All right, maggots, pick a side and keep the numbers even. This is a suicide and a free for all, too. Damien, why don't you socialize by picking your teammates? Shade, you're on blue team. Didn't he say we could pick teams? All right, I'm going with the human dude. Oh. What's the first rule? We only got one. Have fun. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was the first day of school treating you, bro. What do you think? Name's Damien, by the way. Inko, nice to meet you. You two, chrom chrom oh. oh. I thought he was gonna call him Chromosome. I know a guy's uncle that could really make a really classy podium. Damien's. I love Damien. Damien rules. Dude, fucking getting under coach's skin. Do not play smart with Lisa and keep your trap shut and eyes focused on the enemy. <laughs> you got it, Mr. Solly. That's Coach Solly to you. There's no, I got him the ball and start blocking any shots that so much cross our sides would feel. Block one, block two, block three. No. Hey, new guy. Think fast. <laughs> he got fucked. No, I give up. <laughs> oh shit, they broke my sunglasses. Lucky I brought my reserve pair. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Good job, Inko. Jesus. Finally awake shades, I set Ramon straight. The fear of God stricken into me once more. Calm yourself, cadet. You ate dirt pretty hard back there. Oh man, yeah. Wait, you did that. I did. Pelted you right in the back. Do you know why? Because I messed up? Be more specific, kid. Because I couldn't be a good teammate and got hit in the face? Wrong. It was after that. I don't... Nothing happened after that. No, you gave up. But I was doing well, you think so? I was blocking the balls and all. You weren't blocking anything, you were showing off. You found a single thing you could do and started dancing around like a clown. You focused on the easy thing and gave up on the re gave up the real thing. You were so focused that you forgot to look around for a moment. And here you are. I know a defeated man when I see one, and there's no way in hell I'm letting a student of mine give up so easily. The first period of the first day and you're already giving up. Either way, that's a pretty bad lump you ended up with. You gotta watch ar around some students, if you know what I mean. He chuckles to himself. She's something all right. Yeah, I look like the devil herself. Anyways, take the rest of the day off, kid. What? I'm telling you to go home. The principal gave the okay. I feel my head again. Another stab of pain. Am I really not good to go back to class? Wasn't I getting lectured about this just a few moments ago? Well, I want to give up so easily. Now you should go home to your folks. Er, right. About that. We tried calling them earlier. Couldn't reach them. I gave him a sad half smile. Yeah, sounds about right. I can make it home fine on my own. He nods. 
it's twice the length, but I, I haven't really gotten any choices yet. I haven't gotten any choices yet. This is still the introduction. Oh, and here's for tomorrow. If you hadn't been late, you could have changed into those. Aya, right, thank you, sir. Next time shades think faster, got it? Yes, sir. Now scram cadet. I like I like him. I like the coach. <coughs> Damn. <clears throat> There's still all the rest. I still met Ben and Damien. They're pretty cool. I'm not going to let my optimism be ruined just because of bad dodgeball match. Just you wait, St. Hammond. Today was a test run. Tomorrow's the real deal. Jesus. I move an arm from my sheets and feel my head. Yeah, that's bruised real good. Could be worse, though. All right, time to get up. I slump out of bed and yawn, stretching my arms and cracking my spine a bit. My new room is pretty nice. Quite spacious, even with all of the still sealed boxes. I brush my hand over one of them, the one with my other clothes. I'll get around to opening them at some point. Right now, though, it's time for breakfast. The driveway's empty. Looks like my parents are already gone for the day. No surprise there, really. It's all they ever focus on. Ah, oh, poor Incog. I don't even have to read what... At this point, Mom's just wasting paper. The least she could do is reuse the same note and make small... I'll... <laughs> Addendums to it. I snag a plate from the nearest drawer and open up the freezer. No fresh produce to be seen, but there's still the mostly full box of breakfast burritos. Yeah, I've been trying to appreciate ethnic culture more. A plate loaded with a couple of minuscule flour wrapped meals. I set the microwave and wait for the burritos to hopefully not explode or burn inside. Why wait though, I check my phone. Scan over my newsfeed and check out some of the people I'm subscribed to, hoping there's something to watch during my meal. Fortunately, nobody posts videos or streams this early in the morning. Guess I'll just watch a suggested video then. I prop my phone up and click on something random. At the ding of the microwave, I treat my breakfast, carrying it carefully so I don't burn my hands on the bottom of the plate. Ugh, oh, the inside's still cool. I don't want to stick it back in, though. The tortilla would just become a brick then. Top of the morning, folks. By the time the video ends... Who is that? Today, survival. Tomorrow, thrival. That's a good one. That's that's a good one. No, that's a good one. I I like it. I'm going to save here, though. Like a movie poster. Almost. Why is it so dark? <clears throat> How's St. Hammond treating you so far, Mr. Nito? Who is that? How did he even get in here? Oh, I, uh, it's been great so far, Mr. Ferris. He offers out his hand for a handshake, though his palm alone smothers my entire hand. How do you know my name? You're clearly going to school. The nearest one is St. Hammond, and I'm already aware of a new human student. You don't mind my profiling. Whoa, you got all that just from looking at me? I'm partially joking. Your full name is printed on your backpack. You know that's dangerous, right? Yep, that's me, all right. But please, I know it's only been a few days since the year started. I'd like to hear your opinion so far. What am I being secretive for? I'm here to audit your school. See, the teachers know that the students make sure it's a proper place of learning. 
If it were something worth being secretive about, more often than not, just paperwork and office politics. Oh, all right then. Nah, I'm over it. Well, the classes that I have are great, and the teachers I have are a dynamic bunch. Any favorites? I mean, I don't like to have favorites, but all staff seem pretty lively. Ferris lets out a heavy, rumbling chuckle. That's certainly good to hear. And what have your fellow students made any friends? It's been a bit of a struggle, but I've always been that way for me since my folks moved around a lot. I think I'm doing pretty good this time around, though. Why do you think that is? I think it's the jacket. <laughs> Part of the latest catalog I see. Does he need to lean so close to inspect it? If the carriage rocks in any way, he'd probably turn me into a piece of modern art against the window. That's really what the youth are into these days. Hey, the results speak for themselves. Whatever he's thinking about, it's not, got nothing to do with his work. I think I have a pretty good idea. Mr. Ferris. Do no! Inko! No! I'm aware I'm not exactly with it anymore. Well, even the older generation can dress to impress. You just have to see what people today like to wear. I'm certainly willing to listen to the youth of today, yeah. No, fuck that. I'll dress how I want. That, that's how I've always been. I just dress how the fuck I want. If I like a shirt, I'm gonna wear it. And then I'll wear some sweatpants, because I'm still, still kind of tubby. No, yeah, I do dress more, more relaxed. And then, you know, I have my work clothes, which are nice, but that's about it. I can save him? Yeah! He seems like a nice guy. Oh god, those burritos were a mistake. My stomach is roiling after the warm-ups. All right, maggots, today we'll be working on your cardiovascular system. By that, I mean a good old-fashioned mild run. I want everyone out in the track and field yesterday. I know it's Damien Mouth open, as soon as Coach Shaw yells the words. And no, Damien, that doesn't mean I want you to time travel. Unless, of course, you mean running so fast that you hit 88 miles an hour. And just as quickly, Damien shuts his mouth again and shoots Solly a thumbs up. I think, I think that's where I'll stop for now. <laughs> you need to order more clothes? I'm not sure. So, verdict is, uh, th this is better. This is better. Where's the epic fortune humor? After Snoot, I came here expecting my favorite internet memes, such as Flart and Fligu Gigu and Poorly Drawn Fork. Some Andy Six per chance, and what do I get? Nothing. No seared bite, no subtle innuendo to Nicholas Avocado's rear end. Not even a main staple such as the guy with the jar or a Dr. Inco, I'm CIA. Utter disappointment. Uh, I, I, I don't know how to, what, how to feel about that. You won't last five seconds playing this game. Oh, uh, fat tomboy wheelchair alligator. Can I blank the gator in the full game? I love the overweight autistic paraplegic gator grill. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I know, I know, I know how we can we can wrap this up. Where is where's the discussion with goodbye volcano high? I'm gonna I'm gonna read some of the discussion. All right. Oh, forum guidelines. What's the forum guidelines? This is a discussion board for Goodbye Volcano High, so conversations should focus on the game and its development process. Feel free to ask any questions. Please be respectful. Homophobic, transphobic, racist, sexist, or otherwise bigoted comments will be banned. Comments antagonizing or bothering others will also be deleted. While we love and encourage fan art, we don't support works that promote harmful messaging and will delete any fan art or fan art related comments that go against the studio and our staff's values. My favorite part was when Fang looked at the meteor and then said, I guess this is goodbye, Volcano High. 
I like how all these are a jab at that fan game. Yeah, the better one. The better game, you mean? Is that what you're talking about? Uh, okay, so. Oh, thanks for the stream. Well, we're not over yet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wrap up a little with, with by reading some, some. We're gonna have some laughs. We're gonna have some laughs. Looks good. I just want to say this game looks good, and I can't wait. Oh, boring. Uh, is Sam Hyde involved with this? Genuine question. It reminds me of the MLP dating sim. Sam Hyde is in no way associated with this game. He is, as confirmed by the podcast. I hear he will voice Anon. Weird that he isn't in the demo, but I guess they're waiting for the full release. Well, that's good to know. Will Anon be in this game? He should be the MC again. I don't know what Caveman on is thinking. I guess so. Total is the protagonist of the original game. By the way, I look forward to I want to hug a gator. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they got him. They got him. Caveman is too busy working on Snoopborn. B Team is developing this game. Ah, V Vorm, or some say Viverm. Do you hear our prayers? No, we will not abandon the Snoot. He literally me. I wish it were true, but sadly Anon isn't in Goodbye Volcano Hide. In a perfect world, co-op would let Caveman on write it. Imagine unironically wanting Sonichi to be in a Sonic or Pokemon game. But it already is. Sonichi was spiritually in Scarlet and Violet, as seen by that game's insanely high quality matching, the spirit of such great artwork. This is why Americans can never be taken seriously. They miss the most important details. Fang was built for human men, so I couldn't imagine them making this without Anon. Goodbye, Samuel Hyde. Yeah. <laughs> Game idea, Fang 2. It's an extraction shooter in the style of Escape on Tarkov featuring Fang from popular video game. Please deposit money for idea in the following PayPal. Uh, looking forward. Is this a spinoff of Snoot Game? I love that game and look for and would look forward to play this new part. I love the character development based on the different choices that lead to different endings, and seeing how the game mechanics are going to improve on this sequel. I see how this game will become even better. It's been years in the making, and I bet this Snoot fan game will blow us all away. Can't wait for their take on Anon's life adventures. Looks pretty good so far. Her Snoot is just as boobable as ever. <laughs> Demo not working. Uh, oh, the de yeah. Expand your fa fan base. It won the Tribeca Games Award. Sorry, I made this up. <laughs> Sorry, I made that up. If you want more of this game, please try the completed fan game. Snootgame.xyz. <laughs> <laughs> Why is the Goodbye Volcano High Discord so gate cap? Uh, any sane dev would have take would have took the publicity and used it to build hype and show how they tried it. Yeah, here because the game had a fan game made of it during development by a bunch of people on 4chan who loved the designs but assumed the writers would waste the potential. The fan game started out as an outright parody but turned into a genuine labor of love by the people working on it and thus brought more attention to the series. And the main guy behind the project is moving on to make his own from scratch dino and other lizard adjacent VNs with all the positive reception his work got. Some people started talking about this fan game in the Discord, posting art related to the fan game there. Basically gave the devs tons of free publicity throughout a genuinely good fan game that came from a place of love on part of those who made it. Any sane dev team would have took the publicity and used it to build hype and show how they try to make something even better. Maybe even use the fan game as an inspiration to work from. But because, oh no, the evil 4chance made it, the developers threw a fit and banned all discussion of it. Due to the fact they banned all discussion of it over hateful views of the creators of the fan game, people started raiding the Discord with the explicit intent to troll the developers about the fan game, which in turn resulted in stricter moderation, which in turn spurred more trolling, repeat in a never-ending loop. So the devs locked down the Discord to stop the raids, rather than endure the storm of their own making. Really, it was free publicity and they shot themselves in the foot over some political brownie points. And then Mango the Adventurer says, why tell so lies that are easy to disprove? Uh, 
Most developers would kill for something like this. People getting so passionate about your project, they go and make their own game before it even releases. Hell, I know I would if I was a developer, but because of the site it came from, they spat in the face of potential fans in favor of political clout. True, that's what they did. That is 100% what they did. I'm not really going to add anything further here or elsewhere on the swarm, as I don't see a reason to, and I have little interest in David Cage story games or similar products. I was just familiar with a little bit of of history, internet history I felt like sharing. I hope Volcano High makes enough for the studio to keep afloat at least. I can't imagine what I would do if my games got feedback like this. I'd just scrap it, I guess. Well, I mean, that's what they, they delayed it for years, and now their their plan to compete is to make it uh, animated, which, uh, like, I want to hug that Gator it has less animation, but the animation they do have is better than Volcano High's animation. Uh... But seeing them turn down such a massive PR boon has stuck with me as a lesson on what not to do alongside stuff like BFV's marketing and stuff like Yandev and his drama. Delusional. Editing it in so as to not bump the discussion, but for future reference, it's delusional, not delusional. Delusion is the base and thus the all is added. Uh, oh. I can't tell if you people are that insidious or delusional. <laughs> do you have an argument? Where's the lie and what's insidious? This has happened to me in a few Discord servers. Never said a word, but banned. Very weird. Probably Snowflake mods. How fan game is called? Never mind. Found it. <laughs> I don't know, man. The whole genuine piece of love sounds a lot like 4chan gaslighting to me. Yeah. We really care about all this stuff. We don't give a blank about how you feel and the scope of the themes of your game, but we really love it. That's why in our game, we take numerous opportunities to piss on and mock you. But it's all in good fun. We swear, you're the one being unreasonable, and you should appreciate what we've done for you. Any sane dev would kill for what we did for you. This sounds so obnoxiously manipulative. References to Xavier, Renegade, Angel, Samurai, Champloo, Aqua King, Hunger Force, Sage missing, etc. All that is exclusively referential to frequent topics in V or other boards. Yes, yeah, so, but that's funny. Xavier Renegade Angel is the best, one of the best shows ever made. The subtext of the game is almost entirely about 4chan de radicalizing a non binary person back to being a woman, but not so cleverly disguised under the air of. This person was confused and being manipulated by someone else narrative. It is not nuanced or even genuine. If it was, the school shooter ending. Ironic and tasteless considering 4chan and 8chan's history of cultivating that behavior. And city dis destitution ending. Those very clear bad endings wouldn't be the only endings in which Fang remained non-binary. Conveniently, the endings where Fang moves on are the only ones the fans perceive as good or offer any kind of semblance of positivity. Even if one of those endings is still uncomfortable as blank. LMAO, and that's not even getting into some of the other vomit-inducing subtext coming from fringe fortune conspiracy narratives about minorities. It is delusional to have thought that the devs would want to be associated. Don't know why anyone would need to pretend like Snoop Game is some sort of misunderstood fan game. Uh, Poop coping and seething over their bad game being delayed again while the original author of Based and Real Snoot Game already having another game out with a third on the way. <laughs> I love these comments. Because the devs are on some Weenie Hut Jr. shit. They're mad that Snoot Game is being better received than their game and don't want to hear it. I hope we'll see a certain green shirted. Featureless man make a cameo and goodbye volcano high. Uh, it, these people taking Snoop game seriously. But like, they're kind of right. The fact that the fact that Kotaku articles were written about it. Like, that's so fucking childish. Like, 
guys this the, the, the 4chan was being mean to us they made a parody game of us it's like so who cares honest uh, delaying it was like delaying goodbye volcano high was actually the right decision because if they had just released it as as it was and it was just all slides people would have fucking laughed at them people would have fucking laughed that snoot game was able to have higher quality than they did I never played Snoop Game nor own a 4chan account. Well, that's how you know he's not from 4chan. You treat the Goodbye Volcano High, hate them as a rational and functionally consistent group of people that can be lulled into behaving themselves with very specific, simple gestures. But anything that co-op does could and would likely be interpreted as disdain. True. True. You use Gamatsu? I should probably use that. White anglers really be believing this. The devs are butt mad about Snoot Game. Uh, Reddit tards, or the Vebe word. The own Discord servers avoid completely. Remind me to the dead pizza Discord tower Discord server and caves of HUD server? I don't know what that is. Do you really think there's no reason for Fang not to snoot up the... <laughs> no! It's too, if you really think about it, there's no reason for Fang not to snoot up the school. Everybody's going to die anyway. Well, uh, I guess on that note, uh, have a good night. Uh, and take care. And, and like and sub for more. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow or, or the rest of the week. I might just upload more Fallout stuff. I do have a very heavily edited... Uh, fallout video planned for like the alien dlc that i'll that'll be posted when i get to it oh hi heather i'm sorry you showed up when i was about to leave but oh i'm sorry i i'm, I'm, I'm sorry that you missed me i will i will be around more this week because i do have a cool little app that i want to show off that i that i bought on itch.io itch but i will be i'll be around tomorrow all right so so yeah everyone take care i appreciate all of you uh subscribe and like for more and and i'll see you next time you always catch me on the way out oh it's fine it's all it's it's fine uh i think i have my twitter like if if you want to follow my tw my Twitter, uh, I I try to post uh, a link a few hours before I stream, a lot of the times. So like if you follow that, I'll, I'll post stuff about that. I mean if you don't have Twitter, I completely understand. That that place is shit. <laughs> but yeah, no. Uh, you can follow me there, or you know just. I guess you have to turn on the notification bell to get like sub updates. But yeah, that's, that's how you can keep in touch. Uh, take care. Have a good night.